What's up guys, it is your boy TechOrTouchit and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to be unboxing the SS Sniper Wolf Imagine Customs controller. Release the savage. Um, and I'm going to be giving you guys my honest review, the positives and negatives. So let's get straight into it guys. First of all, as you can see the box pretty simplistic, just a plain cardboard box, no branding, nothing on it. Uh, this in fact came by USPS International Shipping. I got it after two months of ordering this thing. I, or I ordered this on July the 13th and now I guess it's September the 19th. But it's finally here guys so I hope it's well worth the wait. And as you guys can see in the box nothing but a simple controller and an invoice, a piece of paper which you guys wouldn't be too interested in it. So let's just get that out of the way. And as you guys can see this is the controller in the simple PS4 box. Um, gonna open that for you guys and give you guys a closer look. So the box really simplistic. Now as you guys can see the first time you look at this controller the design is awesome. Imagine Customs has great designs on their website in my opinion. The smoky effect and also I have my logo as well as my gamer tag or my YouTube channel name rather. So that is one of the main features of this controller which I like. Also this is the PS4 Edge controller so it has two buttons at the back. One of them mapped is X and the other mapped is circle. Now as you guys can see if you're playing a first person shooter or any other game you'll be or any other uh, FPS you're gonna be aiming with this stick right here and if you wanna jump and aim for example you're gonna take your hand off aim of the left stick for a second and press the X button. However with the edge buttons you can just press the edge button instead of moving your hand off the left stick thereby enabling you to jump as well as aim at the same time. That is one of the most compelling features of this controller in my opinion. You can have them mapped to all four face buttons so you don't need to move your hands off the stick anytime. Also you guys can have, uh, I have the X and circle button because for FPS's especially Call of Duty I jump with the X button and knife with the circle button because I play on tactical and yeah so that will allow me to knife and aim at the same time and combat those panic knifers in call of duty now as you guys can see my logo looks amazing right there tgr as well as my gamer tag and this is the ss sniper wolf special edition controller so it has triple s there which is pretty neat in my opinion now the disadvantages guys let's get on to the negative aspects in my opinion this took way long to create even though it's well worth the wait as you guys can see it looks amazing but they took about six to eight weeks to make the thing after that it took about two weeks to ship it depends on where you live so they ship it out with usps and you guys know usps shipping times for me it took a week to ship it internationally which is not bad in my opinion but one more downside with their service is guys don't expect oh crap i almost knocked my camera down don't expect them to reply to your you know service tickets so I asked for a support ticket on the website and they did not reply to it I sent them several tweets at the Imagine Customs page and they didn't respond to that also until I had to take the evasive measure of saying dude I don't want the controller anymore give me a refund and then they responded saying your controller is almost done it's gonna be another day and they sent me a tracking ID with everything else perfectly arranged for and yeah I was able to get it finally after two months so if you guys want a quick custom controller then um, don't choose Imagine Customs because they take a lot of time in, um, as far as my experience goes and as far as many people in the community you can see the comments on their video saying it's taking too long it takes about six weeks to make the thing so you guys have to be patient but in the end you get an amazing product till now in my opinion no damages yet and also guys I did not ask for them to remove the rumble packs but they did which makes the controller extremely light and if you guys have the option of doing that in the future definitely do it because in my opinion really helps out with the weight of the controller and also it helps to improve your aim for some reason and I've been experiencing that with a few games I've played with this controller other than that guys the main thing that attracted me towards Imagine Customs was the customization of course and their designs the designs in my opinion probably one of the best in the controller industry of customization I guess. So you guys can see my logo there pretty well done. 
didn't expect them to put the color logo on it but anyway it's all cool it looks pretty good overall and my gamer tag so that logo and gamer tag customization is not available anywhere in my opinion and as you guys can see it does work of course and the X button I mean they replaced the circle square and X button of the PlayStation controller with the EDGA which looks pretty good um, so let's that is, that is it guys for the video let me know your impressions about this controller so I've talked about the positives and the negatives imagine customs of course not the best service but it's good for what you get and good customization and good designs as well as good functionality now if you guys looking to compare imagine customs and scuff gaming if you're a competitive player and you know you play COD competitively or any FPS competitively I think you should go with scuff but my opinion I had a scuff controller for PS3 and what happened was the back paddles they came off and I had to stick them back with tape and they literally snapped in half which wasn't good because you know when I press, kept pressing the paddles I kept pressing them at an awkward angle and that caused it to snap and I had to stick them back together with tape really inconvenient and that's why I went for these ones which have the buttons on the back which hopefully won't snap if you press them at the wrong angle but yeah that's it guys for the video the Imagine Customs PS4 controller SS Sniper Wolf customized with my name and logo really great, great controller talked about the positives and negatives so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did please leave a like down below subscribe subscribe for me more great call of duty as well as destiny content i can play any game you want me to play just comment down below and i'll be happy to do that so that's it guys for the video comment down below what you think about this controller and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out Your secrets if you really look at yourself you will be speechless what happened to being doctors and teachers